It was popping son is D. So we got another one over here for you. Uh, meet Kenyon once again. What well, what do y'all have for us, man? You y'all really made me numb to a lot of stuff. I don't even know what to say about y'all no more, man. Like, I don't know what this means. Because I, I know what a slumber party is, but oh my gosh, what is this? Okay. <sighs> okay, let me kidding you. Let's go. Y'all ready? Are, are, are y'all honestly ready? Goodness gracious, man. Let's go. Hello, I'm Meat Canyon. I thought I would take a break from the parodies for a moment and tell you all a story from my life. A little chapter out of my book called My First Slumber Party. Okay. I was eight years old. The sun was beginning to set, and I was full. All right. I like this idea. It's very smart as heck. It's very smart. But you don't have to make your voice echo like that. Full of excitement for the night ahead. Me and my friend Luke had been hanging out for a couple hours, playing video games and exchanging our collection of Pokemon cards. Luke's mother had a gorgeous smile, offering Yo. us a supply of benefits. Okay. So you're going in first person. Okay. No need for all of this right now. Banana slices for snacks. Banana slices. It was a normal night. At least, so I thought. Time for bed! We have church in the morning, and we have to get up real early. An ocean of disappointment flooded over me. I was not aware this was a part of the plan. When I think about going to heaven, it makes me just so happy. I want to go there so bad. I want to see my grandma and my grandpa. My youth pastor says they're waiting for me. Okay. I'll race you to my room. He left me there alone. Y'all should make video games. Like you, y'all and Puppet Combo should like fuse together into like one thing with your animation and Puppet Combo's gaming uh, specialties. I should make a game together. To traverse the darkness of his house all by myself. Take the plan, go ahead. All I would like to say is put me in the description. <laughs> Standing confused, I knew I had to push forward. I wasn't going to be the weird kid sitting alone at a friend's house. I had far too much pride. Okay. So you dare give us banana slices, right? You dare give us banana slices and you got pizza rolls? You got pizza rolls? This is disrespectful. You give me banana slices. That would be the first day. I, I ain't looking over here. I ain't looking over there. I ain't looking at none of this. I, the first thing I seen was the refrigerator open and them pizza rolls was right there. And you disrespect me with banana slices. Don't do that. Luke's mother was at the sink washing dishes normally. But what caught my eye was the- Why is she crying? While giving us a never-ending supply of cut-up bananas, Luke's mother recklessly put the banana peels all over the Pokemon cards. Most notably, my Blaziken card. Most notably, my Blaziken card. That's a lot of damage. Which I was obsessed with, since he was my starter in Ruby. I caught her attention by saying, Hey, my dad paid a lot for these cards. Why would you say that? That's so rude. Oh gosh, you're at someone else's house. Just just take the peels off and just get your card back. Oh gosh. She approached me with her beautiful smile. Would you like a snack before bed? I'm sorry for the tears. Mr. Roberts hasn't been acting normal lately. He's been Luke's mother began to tremble talking about something. Yo. Luke's mother began to tremble talking about something, but I couldn't pay any attention. From the corner of my eye, I noticed something. A 40 count bag of combination pizza rolls. Which was fucked because all she offered all night was cut up bananas. It's like, if you have pizza rolls, why not just throw a couple in the oven for your guest? Let alone a child. But I digress. Hey, I'm up here. Come on. Come. Who's that? It's time for prayer before bed.
Why is the whole house like dim lit? I under I understand saving for electricity. Oh my god, I hate people rooms that's like that. You missed our prayer. I hope you're able to sleep okay tonight. What? I hope you're able to sleep okay. Y'all better not be in the same bed, yo. What the? Hey, do you want to play Donkey Konga? What's that? I didn't give an answer. I remained silent. What was that? Still. Suddenly, I was blinded by the light from Luke's TV. And there he was, hitting the plastic bongo drums and giggling to himself. But I noticed something. I noticed that the door was still cracked. And the father was still lingering. With a banana? Room, right at my eyes. He pulled out a banana and started to eat it. Not the boy free of mine, yo. Jaw grating like steel on steel. His you eyes cut your bananas. Open staring forever staring pirate fish yo what is going and that's where on my memory ends. and i have always been fascinated with religion and the afterlife ever since then though it leaves a sour taste in my mouth with a hint of banana what take care everyone bro what are you talking that's about really man scary that is really scary with a hint of banana Good night, everybody. How dare you say good night after you just gave us that weird story? Uh, guess. Oh, I sure digged it, Meat Canyon. I sure digged it. <laughs> like, I most definitely did. Yo, make sure y'all like, share, and subscribe, man, for more content like this and much more. Man, we are halfway there to 1,000 subscribers. How y'all feel about that, man? I'm hype. Holy. Y'all blew up my joint on my last video. Do it again. Do it again. We on the road to a thousand, man. We on the road to a thousand. But also make sure to go follow me on my social media is down below. It's going to be in the description. All the links going to be to the left of me, to the right of you. So make sure to go follow me on them joints. Get updated whenever I go live on Facebook, YouTube, and on Twitch. And I also do bring out little hints of what the next video will be so make sure to go follow me on them johns man all right. i'll see you next time with the next video all right